The stock market is rigged. Look at these three bouncing bull bombs right here. 10 contracts of each cost $2,853. And buying and holding until the end of the session, you returned $11,390. Epic trading session. We called it perfectly. We knew exactly what would happen. We got exactly what we wanted. We look like geniuses today. If only every day was like this. Proof we are geniuses part one. So the first thing we like to do in the morning is look at the pre-market change. How high or how low are we opening? Now on the queue, it was about $3. And you can see that in this column right here. Okay? So when we're looking at all the times it opened $3 higher, what happened? And this is the interesting part. We look at this BB, which means how far we went below the blue line. And every single time we opened around $3 higher, we did go below the blue line. So while this was no guarantee it would happen today, it does help, it gives us perspective. If we see the same setup again, we can capitalize. And that's exactly what happened. One of the benefits of being a premium member, obviously you get into our Discord and we share all of this information with the entire group. If you're a member, we want you to win. Simple as that. So here we say, we opened up three strikes higher. Every other time this has happened, we do go below the blue, below the blue line, below the opening price. So when you see this bounce, early opening price action, pretty choppy, you know, it bounced right at the blue line because we opened at $438.23. And then if you look at the timestamp, this is 8.57 a.m. Central Time, so 10 a.m. Eastern. We want a turbo nuke and then buy calls. Just remember, we can go down two or three. And that's referring to two or three strikes, so two or three red lines on the rigged AI chart. Surprise, surprise, the stock market is rigged. What happened? We got a turbo nuke, and we go down one, 437, 436, 435, three strikes down. And what happens when we get three strikes down? The bulls come back. The bulls, it's a bull market. We're going back up, baby. This one, it's nuking. You're early. But once we get to this three area, money, do the man zeal. Perfect, perfect alert. I mean, look at this thing. It goes for 346%. And this one here goes for 380%. Does it get better than that? No, it does not. We got exactly the setup that we wanted. And even if you didn't want to trade the puts, it doesn't matter, right? Because you make money right here. Like trading puts is hard. We made some money trading these puts, right? But that is not psychologically as easy to execute on as, hey, buying this and watching it go up. Because you get one, two, two and a half strikes higher, like just easy, no stress, no worries. That's 100% trade. Like, come on, come on. And even if you didn't read the Discord and don't pay attention to us, because obviously we have no idea what we're talking about, the strategy on the Rigged AI website gave you what you needed. I mean, let's scroll down and see this thing. What time is this? 11.40. Let's scroll down, scroll down, scroll down. A ton of alerts today. Scroll down, scroll down, scroll down. Okay, first one, bull swing. Caution it fires during the opener middle. This is firing during the middle. You need maximum fear. The price is going to continue lower, and this is a fake bounce, right? It could have been a fake bounce. This is the danger zone where bulls go to die. Why? Because it's high volume. It's possible that we go three strikes down or more on high volume. But we do like it because it's PS minus four or lower, and this is minus 6.93, okay? But caution here, the second one, high risk, high volume, price is likely to nuke beyond three strikes. If it feels early and you're watching this trade, chop, hoping it will go up, you're going to get nuked. But this is, hopefully you know how to read. Hopefully everyone knows how to read here. 
This is where reading comes in handy. Very important. If this is the second bull bomb and it looks like we're bouncing, then take the trade. Look at that. It fits the criteria perfectly. Fits it perfectly. And you're getting 296% if you buy and hold until the end of the session or 363% max gain. Like, same thing, 1142. High risk, because it is risky. When we do nuke lower, typically, or what used to happen before you know, this year, 2024, where we just go up every day, uh, we, would, we would continue to move lower. So it is risky. But if it's the second, this one's actually the third bull bomb in a row, like, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Like, does it get better? It doesn't get better. Other interesting thing that we'll talk about. This one at 1140 comes in exactly $3 down from the blue line. So remember, the blue line opening price. Whoa, ton of alerts. 438.20. So this is coming exactly $3 down. Don't try and tell us that, you know, this like blue line three strike thing doesn't work because it does work. I mean, this is like perfect textbook example. Will it work every time? No, absolutely not. But this is what we want. This is what we trade for. You want to be in these trades. You want to get 200%. You want to get your 300%. Take your money from the market and don't give any back. All right, we're back. We had to take our medicine, calm down a little bit. We open, we move up. Mini nuke. I mean, you can take this, but as soon as you get back up to 438 and it does not blast through it, get out of the trade. Get out of the trade. Trading puts, hard, difficult. You can skip it entirely if you want. Um, but taking the second one right here, I mean, it's not bad. 124%. But that's selling when we get right down to here. The thing about high volume is that you'll notice like, hey, the bears come in, it switches to bulls, and then it goes back up. This is someone raid shorting. This is someone, again, hidden behind, raid shorting. And the way that we like to think about what happens at strike prices or dollar levels, look at what happens at 437. One, two, three. Three, four, five, six. You get six bulls to like two. I mean, that is telling you, hey, hey, Wall Street is betting that the stock market will go back up. Like, you want to draw a line on the chart that says this? We're going to crash? You want to think about inflation? Something like that? Or... Do you want to follow the big money and those genius quants and whatever the heck they're doing over there, right? Like that's how easy this is sometimes on high volume. Every single one of these alerts, I mean, these, these are cut off. They're cut off, but you're getting 200% on every single one of them. Here, you get the next dollar level, and what happens? It's mixed, right? This is very mixed, there's bulls, there's bears, there's bulls, there's bears, and it chops even further, okay? When we see that, you don't need to take a trade there, right? Because it's not going anywhere. Why, why would we want to get into it? But we do get the end-of-day rippy starting at, it looks like, 15.12. All right, let's see this thing. 15.12 could have just logged in at the very end of the day and gotten 144%. Trade it. It says trade it. Hey, look at the bears. It says caution. The market goes up more than it goes down. This alert works best. I mean, this is a good time when it works. Did it work today? No. Because it is a difficult trade. The market loves to pump. End of day pump. End of day pump. Boom. You're killing that one. Boom, you're killing that one. <gasps> epic. And this isn't even the most epic part. Like, this, vis bleh, this video is going to be super long. Too much stuff to cover. Let's keep it rolling, baby. 
The stock market is rigged. Look at SPY. One, two, three, four, five. I mean, you open essentially at the 508 strike and we get five. Do you think it's going to go up? Like, draw a line in the chart. Do this. Do some analysis. It won't help you because Wall Street's just going to do it. How they do it, not sure. But if they're spending hundreds and hundreds of thousands of dollars selling calls and buying puts right here, you want to be on their side. Why? Because you're in an advantage. Positive PS scores. I mean, look at this thing. You get 170%. Bam. Bam. Look what happens. 507, where do we bounce? Boom. One. Okay. Is it going to go up? Do you see any bulls coming in here? Nope. We nuke. Down to 506. Why do we stop at 506? Look at the volume right here. 79.42%. Right here, we're at 70%. We do not expect the move to continue in one direction or the other unless volume is over 110%. So look here. What does PS tell you? Minus 4.48. You get a max gain of 51%. 0 0.54. percent 0 and you get a max gain of 130%. That is why we always need to look at PS. But when this alert comes in and you see it, and you don't look at this and think, I'm a little bit late. You know, prices come down. I'm late. Volume is low. Do I think it's going to go lower? Maybe. But we don't want to play this down here. What do we want? I mean, it tells you. We want bulls below the blue with negative PS. And what do you get right here? Oh my gosh, negative PS, negative 1.91, and you get 289% max gain. Every single bull below made money. Even this one, let's look at it. I mean, you still got 100%. The drawdown was probably like 90% on the way. But every single one below the blue made money. And you actually made the most money trading these at the end. A crazy thing, look at this. 15.55, you got 246% in three minutes. But because that last candle, the final candle of the day, was a turbo nuke, you end up down 40%. Like, that's crazy. Hey, you look at these. 200% in 28 minutes, and you end up with 40%. I mean, all of these got crushed towards the end. Why weren't they as good? Why was SPY not as great to trade today? Comes down to the V word, baby. Volume. 79.42%. We go back to the Q. 110. Which one was easier? Which one did you make more money on? It's simple. It's easy. Rigged. All right. Well, we're going to talk about the most painful experience that we're going to try to drown out with alcohol later today. And that's AMD. My goodness. My God. Let's go. Oh, this is more painful to look at than my wife when she's with her boyfriend. My God. One two, three, four, five strikes on AMD. Five strikes. Like, what an epic session. If you're trading the bulls here from the open, 300%. 8K into 33K. Just buying and holding. Buying and... It's that easy, right? It's that easy. Oh... <sighs> Okay, let's look at this thing. We move up one strike, boom, and then where do the bears come in? Two. Quick money. I mean, you were able to get this quickly if you wanted to, but the thing we need to be looking at is volume, okay? When volume's over 100%, 110%, even AMD can go three strikes. And now I know that three strikes does not equal $3. But... This is just how it works. I mean, look, 
Look, look, look, look, look. One, two, three. This is a bear where you actually made some money. Relatively easy. I mean, you got 74.5% down to here. But just for a second, look what happens when we hit the strikes. We hit the strike. The bulls come in. They're late. Okay. Bears come in up three. Where do we bounce? Right at 185. Right at the strike. We keep going higher. We keep going higher. One, two, three, four. You see four bulls in a row. Did the bears quit? They basically quit. Okay, one, two, three, four. You get half of a strike, and then you get one, two, three, and it just keeps going. Oh, Lord, have mercy. I mean, this is just crazy to see happen. Now, towards the end of the session, you're not getting as much. But remember... You're late, you sold your runners too early, it's ripping, you feel massive FOMO. Oh man, the FOMO is unbelievable. Don't let the FOMO take over. Like, if you just follow that strategy, don't let the FOMO take over. You're okay. You're okay. Dangerous, bear swing. Don't want to trade puts when volume's at 160% and it's just... Like, don't do it. Don't try it. Don't be a hero. You're not going to be a hero. Oh, my Lord. I can't even look at this. This is painful. I mean, it's not as painful now seeing it because today, Thursday, AMD options expire tomorrow. Now, this happened tomorrow, and maybe it will. Maybe we'll see a nuke. Maybe it'll see whatever. Um, you know, you're getting hundreds and hundreds of percentages more like crazy, 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 crazy. AMD at all-time highs? NVIDIA close to 800. Man, it should be an epic trading session tomorrow. But I think the important thing to like know is when you're seeing this volume just spike, okay, we expect the move to continue. 145% above average. Like, it's just going to fly. It's going to keep flying, and that's what it did all day. Oh, mmm. Mm. Let's hope we get something like this tomorrow. To recap everything, the stock market is rigged. I mean, look at this. One, two, three, four, five, and it goes down. We don't like these here because we know we are at a disadvantage. We're at a disadvantage here. We don't want it. We want this. Spy wasn't as good to trade. Why? Low volume. But when we look at QQQ, bam. Bam. Bam again. You can check out all of this on our website. Uh, we have the links in the description below. If you want to join the crew, welcome the new members. Uh, it's $99 a month. I mean, $99 a month. All you need is one day like this, and you pay for a lifetime. Now, will tomorrow be as good? Stock market's rigged. Who knows? Copy trading Wall Street, the best way to win. You guys have a great night. We'll see you tomorrow.